Hey boys and girls, today we're going to be looking at questioning. Um, in your speaking domain, it'll ask you questions like, ask your teacher to go to the bathroom, ask for a pencil, um, ask your friend for a piece of paper, questions such as that. So today we're going to be looking at that and also the difference between talking to your friend and talking to your teacher. Um, so the first thing we're going to look at is if it asked you to ask your teacher um, to go to the bathroom, what would you do? So think about that for a second. If you needed to ask your teacher to go to the restroom, how would you do that? So one way you might do that is you might say, you might raise your hand and you would say, may I go to the restroom? Could I go to the restroom? So that's two examples on how you would ask to go to the restroom. If it asks you to ask your friend for a pencil, how would you go about doing that? You might also say, may I borrow a pencil? Could I borrow a pencil from you? So that's a few other ways to do that. Um, it could ask you as well, um, to ask somebody to do something for you. So you wouldn't say may I or could I, you would say could you. Could you get me a mop? Could you get me a pencil? So that's a few um, examples on how you would ask your friend or teacher for something. Um, let's look real quick on the difference between talking to your friend and also talking to a teacher. Um, when you're talking to a teacher, you are not going to be, um, you're going to use more appropriate words, again, like may I or could I. Um, you're not going to say, give me that. Give me that pencil. Because um, that's not respectful. Um, that's not, so when you're talking to a friend, you might be talking to them and say, give me that. Let me have that pencil. But when you're talking to an adult, you're not going to do that. You would say, may I have a pencil? May I go to the restroom? Could you please give me an extra pencil? Um, could you repeat that? You're not going to tell your teacher, repeat that. Um, because that's just not being respectful to them. So remember, when you're talking to your friends and talking to your teachers, you want to be respectful. You don't want to just demand them to do something, um, especially when you're talking to an adult. You don't want to demand them, give me that and do that for me. Um, you want to be respectful. Again, may I, could I, could you is um, example words you would use. And again, when you're um, talking, when you're looking at your speaking domain and it asks you, um, to ask somebody for help or talk to somebody, you want to be respectful. So, could you sit here and uh, help me with my homework? Um, may you read to me? Could I read to you? So, like I said, just practice these using those. May I? Could I? Could you? Use those um, example stems that I have gave you. And um, like I said, know the difference between talking to a friend and talking to an adult as well. Well, thank you.